Ashes to ashes, dust to dust, rest in peace. Welcome back to Let's Play God of War. I'm Burning Dogface, and I figured I might as well do that at least once to all these graves I'm disturbing. <laughs> We're here in the mines! I'd like to start off by giving a shout out to Roshan, who says, Two people saying Kratos has been a terrible father. I'd like to point out, Atreus has not had to go through the childhood of a Spartan. And if Kratos is willing to take his son to other realms, then I get the feeling he's thinking Atreus shouldn't have to deal with such hardship. And also, shout out to Clunk279, who says on a similar note, In Dungeons & Dragons terms, I would say that Kratos has shifted from his chaotic evil alignment in the original trilogy to being a stubbornly true neutral alignment in this game so far. Which actually sounds about right. Chaotic evil isn't just, like, madmen running around slaughtering everything they see. It's people who don't give a fuck about the law and only seek to, uh, to enrich themselves. You know, lawful evil isn't someone who, like, Oh, I've killed a bunch of people, but I used a loophole to get around it so you can't arrest me. No, it's, I've bent the rules of the land to fill my pockets with gold. It's like political corruption. Alright, lost the thread somewhere. Now we're back here. Stupid question, but... Actually, I guess that would have made it worse, so that's probably for the best. Then that one cuts and the bridge falls out from under me. The way I am aware... ...standing still talking to you guys. But in my defense, I have tried to do it on the run, and uh, it just keeps coming up with every time I try, I just keep running into tr conversation triggers. So I know it's a bad habit, I'm trying to break it, and uh, it's just kind of tricky in this particular game. And in fairness, I did have it all reinforced by uh, Alan Wake, which had exactly the same problem. What am I missing? Well, I guess there's that. Oh! I didn't think it was weird there was nothing dangling from it. Well, what the fuck am I missing? If we're not going that way... I guess this is just treasure and I was wasting my time. Fuck! Have I been in here? Is this not... No, I guess this isn't how we came in. No, this is where I found treasure, wasn't it? Oh, that's right! Yes! I did forget about that. My bad. Look! Another lantern! Broken. Leave it. What could they be for? There's something special about them. I can feel it. Okay, Kratos. I know you're not used to this. But the kid has shown some kind of weird perception abilities. You should listen to that. I know he's like 10, but maybe you don't dismiss that out of hand. <laughs> now, if I hit X here, I mean, is he just going to shoot an arrow past me, or do I have him run up here and do the thing for me? Oh, yes, I thought so. See, every time he kicks one of those chains, actually, it's not true, but this particular time as he kicked those chains, I did think to myself, it was nice that he's upgraded from uh, the sandal boots to proper boots, because otherwise he just would have whacked his toe into the metal. And I'm not sure that would actually bother him. You know, I'm just saying. It's working! Hang on, that's really how that was meant to be done? How the hell did the dwarves do it? They have, like, half of uh, Kratos' body mass and none of his supernatural strength. <laughs> oh, right. Yes, that's where we are.
I know, I just need to check every time. Doesn't look like it's working. Yeah. Doesn't feel like it's working either. It's not changing colors, it's actually a rage stone. You have any idea how dangerous that would be in real life? Imagine you're just going for a walk, you don't realize it, and you step down on the thing that fills your entire body with supernatural anger. Actually, I'm not sure it is supernatural. Yes, I see the button over there this time. I'm gonna run up here, though, because there's this! Aha! I have no idea what this is for. Right now I need to know what this is for, because I just thought that was... This is the exit, though. I don't have to leave. I'm sure we can figure this out. Oh. Oh, even better! It's not missable, it's optional. Delicious. Still need to free the rope. Think you can use the cart to get oh, us Oh fuck, there? this is there. The cart. Oh, the giant one. Also, I totally didn't realize where we were, I will admit that freely. I did think it was kind of weird there was just a rage stone lying there. Oh! God damn it! I can't believe I didn't see that. I need to go with it, bring this out there. Quad tracks, I like that. I also like that it looks, if you look closely, it seems like there's actual scratch marks on the ground from this heavy-ass thing dragging over it over and over again for hundreds of years. Let me just, uh, check for a pulse. I can't find a pulse. It's weird, he stepped out of the way like the camera was Kratos. All right, no, I can't. There was, uh... In the original God of War, there was a lot of pushing puzzles, but there was a command I liked where either you could push them around by hand like this, or you could hold down the attack button to charge up a kick that would shove the block you're currently pushing as far forward as it could go until it either ran out of momentum after, like, 30 feet, or far, far more often, because it was usually in puzzle rooms, until it slammed into a wall or another obstacle. I don't know how this helps, but we're doing it anyway. Oh! Fucking hell. I still didn't see that. Right, because I can get over there now. Is there a pull push on the other side? Oh, it's at a hidden incline. That's kind of funny. No, and I can't even get there. Fuck it. I'll just pull. Probably worse than your back, but it's not like he cares. I'm not even okay. sure if he ages or not. Really? All right, son. I think it's up ahead. Like a giant jawbone for a moment there. I saw this earlier. This bit of uh, leather. This looks fresh. Surely this would have rotted if they just left this here when they abandoned the place. Mind you, the torches are all still going. Well, these aren't. I just keep drawing attention to that. It's probably important. <laughs> falcons dive. Summons a cast of spectral falcons that dive into the ground! I mean, I don't really see the... Got a lesser cooldown. I guess I could throw that on. See what it's like. That is not the equip button. That is the equip button. Hmm. Sign of respect to Sir Nunos. Sign of disrespect to Sir Nunos. Sir Nunos. 
I think I've seen that written before. Like, I've seen the name used in, like, boss fights in unrelated video games, but... Or something like that. But, uh, I don't actually know how it's pronounced. You know, none of those would have been plot-relevant, but for boss fights, that's the kind you put at the end of a dungeon. Well, that looks heavy. Okay, that makes way more. Yeah, this might be the part where uh, Atreus now goes, Now hang on! that button! You did it! I thought we could make the rope wheel work now. Why give us the way to the top? However, we have trapped Sindri inside his shop. So I'm afraid he's going to starve to death. Uh, what? Oh. It won't let me step onto the wood. Oh. Maybe that's for the best. Oh, that's right, yeah, it fell down and fucked everything over here. Alright, what I got from that was, you know, from that no way was more, my dad is the coolest, than it was, uh... Then, hey, that's actually supposed to be him. Okay, Yarn Fodor? Nice block! If there absolutely was a roar button, I absolutely would! Shit, he's got my element. How can I do that? Okay. He just shot him in the face and he didn't even twitch or anything. Not so much that time! How do you like it, fuckhead? I'll freeze your jewels, you fuck! God damn it, you can't do that. Well, he's not immune to the shit, that's for goddamn sure. How is he not even bleeding? Oh, my God. Douse!
dead. Back to the wheel. Actually, that reminds me. Let me just change this. The path of the traveler. Uh... All right, that one does look pretty rad. Let's go with Buckler of the Forge, since we've made friends with two legendary dwarven blacksmiths and all. Nice. Yarn Foter. Mother said this troll... Wow, did, did, did she seriously tell you individually about every troll in the world? Mother said this troll lived in the heart of the mountain with a giant. There was a falling out one day and they cast him out. Makes sense to me. I wouldn't want to live with a troll. Guess he moved back in when they left. Hmm. I mean, it's it's literally free real estate, you know. Meme aside, they power up their weapon and move uh, and attack with a forward-moving shockwave. Hey, it's a frozen flame. Why did you have that? Yeah, they put the dwarves probably left it here. I wonder what it is. Two more. Cause we're reaching to. Uh, mm. Now where do we go from here? To the end of the journey, I guess. We are on the mountain after all. The River of Knives. I, I immediately need to know what this is. A destructive attack. It sends out a line of ice shards that inflict frost damage and launch enemies into the air upon uh, contact. Okay. Okay. I'll give that a shot. But if I'm going to do that, I'm going to want a, uh, a spread attack for this. Yeah, yeah, sure. I'll do that. You know, something that just hits everybody around me real quick, and I need to say, no, everybody back off. The wheel, the wheel. It was over there, was it? Yes! My first thing to get, uh, recharge my anger. Mm, rage flavored Kool Aid. That's a big fucking chunk. So I guess we we don't have to leave was an illusion then since this is the same chamber. I guess the idea earlier was that he wasn't that Atreus wasn't strong enough to you know hold the wheel in place, but because he'd moved it uh, after all these years, it just suddenly the slack gave out. You got the claw back. <laughs> Go, it'll go back up. Oh, there it goes again. Oh, I see. Oh, that's weird. Yes, nice shot. There's a chest in there. Oh, right. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Well, there is no bar on this side, huh? There were probably four of them at one point. Oh, I see what we're doing. I don't think anyone, uh, anything that size is really supposed to move that fast, but... Hey! Wait for us! Oh. 
Okay. What, this? That's thought, it. I never thought of damaging the wheel itself, I have to admit. I mean, geez, with that we could have just hold on, held on to the claw prongs. I thought it would wait long enough, or like, move real slow so we could still get on. And hold, race yourself. Here we go. Do you think this goes all the way to the top? We will see soon enough. Something feels strange up there. We're heading into danger. Do not concern yourself with what might be. Focus on what is, and be vigilant. Yes, sir. I can't put the axe away. That feels weird. Not the top. Oh, we're closer. Oh, wow. That was perfect timing for the timer. It does that sometimes. Wait! That one's not broken! There's a note. A giant's prayer. They're asking their ancestors to watch over them. To guide them home. Boy. Wait. I think I know how it works. Is that Faye's name? Is that one of these? Is it one of those memorial things I've heard of? I mean, I thought that was an yeah. Asian thing, but... Wow. Yeah, that would seem like magic, wouldn't it? Ah, oh. yes. What did you write? I asked them to watch over mother. Do you think they'll watch over us on the way to the top? Come, boy. It is a long way up. <sighs> it wasn't that fatherly, but. He didn't say no this time. I felt like he resisted Whoa, the urge to say back. no. Whoa! I mean, I kind of need to do an outro, but... A tunnel boy. Got it. Be careful. But actually... Shit. Okay. I'm burning dog face. And I will see you on the next episode of Let's Play God of War. As we keep moving through the mine and do our very best to be incinerated. Till then, have yourselves a great day. Later!